Hey everyone and thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you're all doing well. I hope you guys are all staying safe. In today's video, I am going to show you a pastel spring inspired eye look. The palette I'm gonna use is this one by Huda Beauty. It's from their new pastel collection. And the one that I'm using is the Pastels Rose palette. It has like really soft pink colors. It has some yellows. And this palette just really screamed spring to me. So I thought this would be the perfect palette to create a spring eye look. Now, before I go in with any eyeshadow, I'm first going to prime my eyelids. I'm going to use the Sigma Beauty P84 brush together with the MAC Cosmetics paint pot in the color Soft Ochre. And I'm going to apply this all over the eyelid. Um, this will cover up all the redness from the eyelids. And this is going to make sure that my eyeshadow is going to stay in place all day long. Now the first color I'm going in with is the yellow color, which is a really soft yellow color, which I think is perfect for if you want to create like a really soft yellow eye look. Now all the brushes I'm using today are included in my brush set, which I created together with Sigma Beauty. I have all the details linked down in the description bar. And I'm just going to pack on this eyeshadow color in the inner corner of the eye. I went back in with this shade a few more times because it's a really light color and I wanted it to have like as much color payoff as possible. So I think I went back in like four times. Then now for the next color, I'm going in with this soft pink color. I actually wanted to create a gradient from light to dark, but this eyeshadow color turned out to be lighter than the yellow. But at the end, I'm actually really happy because it's going to give a really cool effect. But the middle part is now a bit lighter. Then now for the next color, I'm going to take this pink color, which is more of a mauve pink shade is really beautiful and i'm gonna blend this in the outer v of my eye you can now see that i have yellow in the inner corner a really light color in the middle part and this pink color at the outer v which wasn't really what i wanted to go for with this eye look but i actually think it looks really beautiful and later i'm also gonna apply like a shimmery color on top of the middle part which is gonna make it look really soft and subtle so I just kept blending, then I went back in with the P84 brush from Sigma Beauty with a little bit concealer on it and I'm going to blend it like right underneath the edge of the eyeshadow. This is going to kind of clean it up and make it all look more neat and less messy. So after doing this, I went in with a little bit more of the yellow eyeshadow again, just to give it more color payoff because I still wasn't really satisfied with how it was looking. And then after that, I went in with the middle shade, which is in the middle part of the palette, just using my finger and pressing a little bit of this eye color in the center of the eyelid. This is actually a super pretty color. I swatched it on my Instagram in my Instagram story. And when you look at the eyeshadow in the palette, it looks like a really weird texture, kind of like a leopard print or something. It's really pretty and you wouldn't really expect like how the color would look, but it's really beautiful and really subtle. Now I'm going in with this color and I'm going to kind of press it right above the lash line using a Sigma Beauty E15 brush. Um, I wasn't happy with how light it was. I wanted it actually to be a bit darker. So after I pressed it above the lash line, I felt like, let me just make the brush wet and see how that looks. So now I made the brush wet using a little bit of setting spray and you can see it turns to be bit darker which I think looks a bit better if you like the softer version more of course you can keep it that way but I wanted the lash line to stand out a bit more and then I just smudged on top of it with a blending brush with no product to make it a bit more soft and then I went back in with the E15 brush and that same color and also applied the shade right underneath the lower lash line this way the color Underneath the lower lash line blends into the color in the outer V area. And then I started blending it with a really soft blending brush. Then now to top it all off, I went back in with this yellow shimmery color, which I haven't used yet. I just wanted to play with like as much colors as possible that come in the palette. And then after applying the color in the inner corner, I also went back in with the middle color in the palette. And I'm applying it underneath the lower lash line in the middle part. Then now for my mascara, I went in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills newest mascara. And after applying mascara, I went in with some fake lashes. 
and that is already the last step of today's eye look so yeah if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up this is really helpful for my youtube channel also don't forget to subscribe if you aren't already and yeah thank you so much for watching and hopefully i will see you all in my next video bye bye honestly i shouldn't caught up in my feelings messed up and i'm sprung something in your smile that it makes me wanna come over can i come over i wanna come over thinking about your ocean